With Visual Staff Scheduler employee scheduling software, you can instantly view shift coverage by hour, half hour, or a quarter hour time increments, and see who is scheduled for a particular time. In the hourly coverage window, you can obtain a detailed on-screen listing of which employees are scheduled for a particular hour, view coverage graphs by position, and even see your coverages update dynamically as you make changes to your schedule. Click on the hourly coverage button from the toolbar, or select hourly coverage from the view menu to open the hourly coverage window. You can choose the desired time increment by clicking on the drop down arrow and selecting 1 hour, 30 minute, or 15 minute time increments. You can switch to another time increment at any time while viewing hourly coverage. Click the graph button to view hourly coverages displayed in a graph format. Double click on the selected cell or click on the details button to see a list of names and schedule information for people who are scheduled to work during that time. You can select other coverages by clicking on a column header and selecting a query from the Select Query dialog window. For example, you can view hourly shift coverage for a specific group of employees such as all staff on the night shift. Let's take a look at a query selection. The Names tab is used to designate which names should be included in the query. By default, all names are included in the query. You can deselect the option Ignore Name Checking to handpick individual names from the list, or select Check by Position option to include groups of employees based on a position such as managers or account reps. Use the Skills tab to designate the skills or certifications that should be included in the query. Select which explanations, if any, should be included in the query. Select which shifts should be included in the query. If multiple shifts need to be selected, press the control key on your keyboard and make that selection. As a general rule, when defining your query, you should select all available shifts. In this example, we only want to see the employees who are working the night shift. Enter the note text that should be included in the query. For this particular query, the entry in the Notes tab isn't needed since searching for shift annotations doesn't apply to this query. Now you can see in the fifth column the number of staff who are scheduled to work during the night shift. Let's look at another coverage total by clicking a column header in the hourly coverage window. To create a new query, select the New button. We'll create a new query that shows the employees who are scheduled to work and also speak Spanish. We'll type in a new name for the query and by default choose all of the employees. Use the Skills tab to designate the skills such as speaking Spanish. To select a particular skill or skill set, click on the Edit button and make your selection. For this particular query, we'll choose Spanish. Select which shifts should be included in the query. Since we want to make sure we always have an employee who speaks Spanish, we'll choose day, evening, and night shifts for this query. Now you can see in the sixth column how many Spanish-speaking employees are working at all times. In addition to the hourly coverage window, you can also display coverage total results at the bottom of the screen. The coverage totals can display either the total numbers scheduled or the staffing variance. Staffing variances are displayed as negative numbers to indicate staff shortages, positive numbers to indicate staff access, and no number to indicate that the actual coverage meets exactly the staffing requirement. Visual Staff Scheduler allows you to easily view your hourly shift coverage and see who is scheduled for a particular time.